Bright Angel Point is the most visited viewpoint on the North Rim. The trail starts just east of the lodge and provides a half mile round trip to the point and back. The Park Service estimates the walk takes about half an hour. For a rim to rim hiker, the trail is a nice stroll, but to a casual visitor, it can be surprisingly steep and traverse some dramatic drop offs that may concern people with a fear of heights. But for casual visitors, if you take breaks and proceed slowly, it will provide an unforgettable view of Grand Canyon. The point is often crowded midday, as many visitors to North Rim only stay for the day. If you're spending the night, the best time to visit is the early morning, when it's possible to be the only person on the point. As you're reaching the point, if you're quiet, you can hear Roaring Springs, which provides the drinking water for both North and South Rim. Power lines down the Roaring Springs Canyon will point you in the direction of the springs, but you can't see them. Originally, the Forest Service had a fire tower on Bright Angel Point, first wood and later metal. A large metal tower was built on the point in 1928. In 1933, the CCC moved the tower to the north side of the park near the entry gate, where it's now known as the North Rim Lookout. Rim to Rim hikers will look to the Roaring Springs Canyon, where they completed their hike to the trailhead, as well as down the North Kaibab Trail and crossing the canyon to a nice view of Bright Angel Trail where it reaches the South Rim. If you'd like to come along, Here's a short record of the walk down the trail to the point. If you make the trip to North Rim, Bright Angel Point should not be missed. I hope you enjoy your visit and thank you for watching.